Hello everyone, today's the day that I head off on my next adventure. We're going to Atlanta, Georgia today. I'm gonna to meet up with some friends and we're gonna have some really good times, so I'm super duper looking forward to it. Unfortunately, this entire first day and possibly the first video is probably just gonna be a bunch of footage of me traveling to Georgia. It's gonna take pretty much the whole day. Still, I'll try to get some cool shots for you guys and hope you enjoy. All right, before we leave, let's go eat some breakfast. Ten out of ten. We'll eat again. That was a good time to tell a story about my dog, who's traumatized by any sound that beeps. See. My dog is super triggered by beeping sounds, including the ones on this camera, which is why I'm outside right now. That happened because as a child, we trained our little dog with an electric fence and the collar would make a very high pitched beeping sound whenever she would get close to the line. So now whenever she hears any beeping sound at all, even if it's not remotely like a beeping sound, maybe it's a clicking sound, she gets triggered and gets very, very scared. So that's why I'm outside right now. It's actually pretty nice out. Bye, Dad. Bye, Mom. I'll see you guys later. So, now I'm on my own and I have to figure out where my gate is. I'm taking Spirit Airlines to Georgia. Uh, but we ended up getting dropped off at the arrival section, not the departure section. So, I'm a little lost right now. Excuse me. Do either of you know where like the departure section of the airport is? I got dropped off at the arrivals, but I have to uh go up. Spirit. Spirit. Go all the way across the street and go up one way. Okay, thank you so much. We're in the wrong section of the airport. longer lost. Spirit Airlines is right here. That's the flight I'm going to be taking. Let's go pick up our ticket. I just got an error saying my flight's been cancelled. Now I gotta go to customer service. Where, where should I go for this? Okay, cool. So, my flight was cancelled by Spirit because apparently there's some remnants of a hurricane going through Georgia right now, but I'm stuck at the airport. Uh, I managed to get a refund and I gotta go find a new flight from a different airline. So we're gonna go do that. All right, so these two guys that I met right here, <laughs> they also were on Spirit Airlines and they also got their flight canceled. Why'd you guys, why'd your guys' flight get canceled? Uh, because Spirit is asshole. <laughs> Apparently Spirit is an absolutely terrible flight. So now we're both over at JetBlue, which is like the best airline. Yeah, so. <laughs> exactly. Hopefully they can solve our problems for us. We checked around, we're looking, we looked at different flights, and basically nothing was available today for us to go out. So what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to schedule a flight for tomorrow. Hopefully it won't be too expensive and we'll see if we can still make it on this trip. Time to skip for tomorrow in three, two, one. <gasps> oh man, that was a horrible nightmare.
Just kidding. This is actually a time skip. Ta da! It's like I didn't even leave. Now we're headed to the gate. I'm gonna be taking JetBlue this time around. And my flight doesn't leave for a couple hours, so I think I'm gonna grab something to eat first. What should we get? What should we get? That was delicious. I was actually going to take this time to complain about airline food or airplane food at the airport because the rice bowl that I got there was $10, but they ended up giving me enough food to feed like two people, so I think it balances out. Plus they gave me a free water bottle, so thank you. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta white balance it. There we go. Now it's going. So I gotta go to the baggage claim over that way? Okay. This is where we say goodbye? Yeah. It's been fun. It's been fun. Nice to meet you. Good luck. Good luck. Thank you later. He's a nice guy. Now I gotta hit a baggage claim even though I don't actually have any baggage because the train station is where I need to be and the exit to the train station is over there. So let's go. I didn't realize I was this far underground. So I found my way to where I'm supposed to be, and I'm supposed to meet up with a couple of friends here, but I'm not entirely sure where they are. So I'm wondering if I'm a little bit lost. Hopefully I'll run into them soon. There they are. They're right there. Hey! <laughs> Look at that. Oh man. Come here. Ah, it's good to see you guys. You look like such a, you look like such, you look like such a tourist. <laughs> I know. That's the point, right? Okay, so we stopped at Hooters for dinner, which is the first time I've ever been to Hooters before. Food was actually really good, but I had a pretty traumatic experience in the bathroom. The entire floor was covered in water, and I almost slipped immediately upon entering the bathroom. So that kind of brought my experience down a little bit. Aside from that though, now we're gonna head back to the place I'm gonna be staying, and I'm gonna unpack my stuff there. Idea where I'm going. Lead the way. We're like lemmings. We just follow the crowd. Wait, there's an airport here? Yeah, but it's a small airport. Dang, I wish I could have flown in there. That would have been so much more convenient. They're always, always freaking crashing. They're always crashing. God. Airport's already seen so.
All right. 102. And we're off. Whoa, this is sweet. Well, finally made it to Georgia. And it turns out we have a pretty awesome place to stay. So I think this is gonna be an awesome trip. I'm gonna end the vlog here though. So until next time, I will see you all later. <laughs>